Hi guys, Toaster. Um, today's video, or this video, I'm going to do another one later on. Um, it, this video is not really about wild camping directly. Uh, this one's about mental health, and specifically, um, I want to talk about men's mental health. Today's the 10th of September. Um, I've been hearing a lot on the radio about today being Suicide Prevention uh, Awareness Day and uh, about this week being Mental Health Awareness Week. Uh, for me, that's a bit silly. Uh, every single day should be Mental Health Awareness Day. And one of the things that I come to year know over the years, and I, I have suffered with depression and anxiety for quite a few years now, and one of the things that I've come to realise is that men's mental health is actually a big concern. Men have got this image that we all try and live up to of being macho and being strong, silent type. Um, I'm not the strong, silent type. You probably can tell from my other videos. Um, I do suffer. Sometimes I suffer more than I let on. Um, quite often I suffer alone. And the reason that I end up suffering alone isn't because of any other reason than sometimes it's really difficult to reach out. So as a plea to anybody out there who is suffering, reach out to someone. It doesn't have to be someone who's qualified. Sometimes you just need to talk things through. Um, my wife gets upset with me sometimes when I'll tell her after the event that I've had a dark couple of days. Um, this week I've been suffering with a cold. Uh, you can probably hear in my voice that I'm still on the recovery side of, of cold. And when you're suffering with a cold or something like that, when your physical health is deteriorating or deteriorated because of illness, it's really easy for your mental health to suffer too. Um, I, I found that with my physical strength, physical well-being, um, I've actually, over the last six months, while we've been in lockdown in the UK, thanks to the COVID-19 um, pandemic, I've actually been fortunate enough that I've watched what I've eaten and I've lost about three stone. Um, and I, I can tell you now, I feel fantastic for it. Not just physically, but I feel fantastic mentally for it. Uh, one of the reasons that I enjoy going for a walk in the woodlands and one of the reasons I enjoy going wild camping is because getting away from technology, I don't know it sounds stupid doing a video saying I'm getting away from technology, but getting away from technology a little bit can be really good for your mind because it allows you to get rid of some of those distractions and just focus on what you need to think about. Quite often we, we find that we are distracted by things. Uh, social media can be a real distraction sometimes and can be really negative. Um, I know personally that... I don't have very many followers. I think at this point while I'm doing the video, I think I've only got seven subscribers on my channel on YouTube. I don't care. Not at all. I mean, yes, if people want to see the video, great. But I, I don't care whether people want to subscribe. I'm doing these videos for myself. Um, and I'm doing them so that I can get my thoughts out um, in an easy sort of fashion. And also so that people can see that we're not all strong that's why i'm doing this video um we don't always have to be strong guys if you're suffering let somebody know talk about it um that doesn't make you any less of a man it doesn't make you any weaker for talking about some of the things that are going on in your life share